I've had a couple on this subject. Have you? And this is from Don't Read My Name, 4396. Oh. Does he have a name on there? But No, it's Don't Read My Name. That, that is yeah, his so name? I read it. Okay. Please ask Lee how long to rest between warm-up sets and <sighs> how long to rest between hard sets. I never heard him talk about rest times between sets. Because I don't talk about rest times. You just go when you're ready. No, well, why did you have the, the stopwatch going up? <laughs> Flipping! <laughs> like the old circuit. Remember the yeah, old yeah. days where you'd... They used to have the timer on the wall and after 30 seconds, bang, then you move to the next station. I never, I never timed it. I just went when I was felt good. Like, sure, on leg days, if you're squatting heavy and doing stuff, you're going to... There's someone who goes, well, should I take 30 seconds? If I was squatting heavy and I took 30 seconds break and say I was squatting five, six plates, if I haven't got my breath back and all I can pump out is another three yeah. reps, I'd rather take a minute and a half and do a set of eight reps. Yeah. So, but generally too, it's like if you've got a training partner or someone, it'd be like, I'd be like, he does his set, I do my set and then, you know, back and forth that way. So, if you change the weight, then he gets off, I put the weight on and I go. So, yeah, it's like, but then off season though, it could just be, I didn't really worry about it. I just, like I said, when I just felt like I had my breath back and did it, sometimes, you get chatting to someone at the gym and the <laughs> guy could be like, fuck, five minutes has gone past before I've done my next yeah. set. So if I was getting ready for a contest, I'd try and keep that pace of, if I was training with somebody, I do my set, he does his, yep. I do mine, he does his. But if it was off season, I could just do a set, do a couple of sets. And then like I said, I might chat to someone five, 10 minutes. Yep. Then I do another set. So yeah, but generally if I talk that long, it'd be like at the end of that exercise. Yeah. You know, I wouldn't do it like halfway through squats because then it's like you'd start to cool down and that. But if I just finished squats, then I might chat to someone for five, ten minutes before I moved on to leg press or something. But then once I'm in leg press, it'd be like, I go, they go, I go, they go. So, but there's really no rhyme or reason. It's just, however, whenever you feel you're ready to, as long as you can give 100%, there's no, like I said, going back in if you're still. <laughs> yeah. It'd be like, say, if you're sparring or boxing, and you know, you do a three minute round, ding, ding, rather than give them a minute, 15 seconds, oh, back in there, you'd yeah. be like, oh, fucking hell, I'm not ready to go yet. So, you know, so you gotta, you wanna, you wanna, as long as you can go back. So like I said, everyone's different on cardio fitness and how you feel, but as long as each time you've had your rest, you go back and you can do 100% and give it everything. So I wouldn't wanna, like I said, go back and just be like 30 seconds and then pump out three reps. If I had to wait a minute, I could pump out eight, so. And also too, you've got to have that thing where you, you know, some people would take that as a license just to um, um, do a set, be on their phone for 15 minutes, oh, yeah. do another set. Well, I've seen that too, because like I said, you can be on the phone at home and sometimes we're like, let me just quick this check, I'll quickly just check something. And before you know it, I'm like, fuck, 15 minutes has gone past. Like when you get on your phone and you fucking start Wait. scrolling, I see people at the gym doing that. I've, act I've actually watched a guy once when I had done a whole, I say I was doing lap pull downs. I've done a whole five, six sets of lap pull downs and he's just done one set of bicep curls and sat there on his phone. And I'm just looking over thinking, I've done a whole six sets here and you've only done one set of bicep curl because he's just on his Might phone. Might have been training thumb. <laughs> but I guess the, the best way to put it is, so you're going in to, you know, name whichever body part you're going to train. Mm. You want to do X number of exercises, X number of sets. So you don't want to be there all day. No. Um, but you've got to get the work mm -hmm. done. But you know, I've always found upper body a minute's enough, really. A yeah. Minute. yeah. If you, you know, sure, if you're doing like back and you're doing heavy deadlifts or barbell rows, things like that, the big heavy basic movements or squatting, maybe you need a two minutes, but generally anything else on arms or chest and stuff yeah. like that, generally a minute, you should be ready to easily go again. By the time you get off, like I said, and change the weight, sit down, have a sip of water and that, a minute is sometimes a while at the gym. Yeah. Well, that's why I like um, um, plate loaded equipment versus weight stacks. Mm -hmm. You get up, change your weight, yep. like you say, have a drink, mm -hmm. um, 
and then by the time you Unless do you're it, doing leg press with someone that's weaker than you and then you got to put all your plates on then take all your plates off you're like fuck it mate you can just wait till nah, i'm finished nah, nah, <laughs> nah, super setting <laughs> doing yeah. a um mm -hmm. leg press and arm curls and pressing or i do you. my set that as i'm doing my set i always just make them do a drop set start taking plates off so when we get back to four plates that's what they're doing so they're actually taking the weights off i'll put them on and they can take them off that's, that's i'll do as many trick. as i can say if i'm doing eight plates i'll do as many as i can i'm like take one off i'll do a couple take one off and when we're back to four plates what they're using okay then i stop <laughs> <laughs> i just have them unloaded <laughs> that's the best way yeah but generally like i said if it's a bigger body part you know, two minutes should be enough but yeah the power lifters take a fair bit in between but you know, see you don't want to take like i said dawdle to where like i said you're losing your pump and yeah going cold so you should know you should be able to gauge it yourself pretty good yeah but like i said sometimes i get chatting to someone then it's like yeah i've often done that where i'll be like just halfway through it say i'm doing like bicep curl and we're going to do six sets i've only done three i'll start talking to an older guy we get chatting and then by the time he leaves i'm like oh, okay i'll go do barbell curl now because i've cooled down that much i'm like oh fuck that exercise i'll go start a new one now well despite the fact that um apparently you've got your um, um got no cardio endurance um it is actually good that like bodybuilders do have some form of cardio because mm -hmm. you know as, as you get more intense lift heavier weights mm -hmm. um you, you don't need as much rest but if you're out of shape oh, yeah. cardio like one set and you takes mm -hmm. you longer to recover so you probably have, that's the reason why you could only, you only needed a minute because mm -hmm. you were well it depends what you're doing too because if you're squatting heavy you know, it takes it out of you. Yeah. You put that weight back. Once that weight comes off your back, you're like, <gasps> yeah, you're yeah. Like, even even while you're doing it, you're out of breath. But once you put the weight back, it's like, <gasps> yeah, it's like fucking hell. Or yeah. even leg press. I can sit there, like I said, doing those leg presses. Yeah. And I was out of breath doing all those high reps. But w once you stop and lock it back in and get up, then you really, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you're, you're you're not focused on your breathing. Exactly. So yeah. yeah. The same as like I said when you know, I was doing the sparring you're out of breath and shit but then when they say okay take that minute you're sucking air in like yeah. i've only got a minute yeah <laughs> so yeah